if you just put a bunch of stuff around you, it looks like a design scheme. The real scheme is that I have no f***ing clue about interior design. It's time for another edition of Interrogator's Grace! It's just my version of a Q&A, but I gave it a different name. I went on my Tumblr, GraceHelpy.tumblr.com, and I asked you guys to give me some questions for me to answer because that's how the internet works. You watch someone that you sort of have an interest in, answer a question that you have little to no interest in, and it makes you not think about death for a second. Yay, YouTube! What do you usually do between takes when the camera is still running? What if hot air balloons had legs attached to the bottom of them that just ran in place while they floated through the air? Usually I think about things like that or just that. You guys really want bloopers and if you think that that is a blooper, then I got I feel like you two should be dating. I ship it. That was my attempt at youth relevance. Will the No Filter Show ever come to the southeastern U.S.? For the month of August, the No Filter Show will not be coming to the southeastern U.S. We will only be going to Boston, D.C., Austin, Los Angeles, and San Francisco. However, later this fall, there might be some more tour dates announced, and as soon as they are set, I will announce them. I'm not going to set it and forget it. I'm going to set it and alert you. I'm in a drama camp starting soon. I'm really nervous about it like I'm gonna mess it up. So what can I do to motivate myself? Please help. And this is overall advice that you can use for starting any sort of camp or club or school year or any of the things that involve you having to deal with social pressure, social judgment, socializing. Allow yourself to be open to success and failure. It's gonna happen. One or the other or both. Try and be present in the moment and try um have fun. Yeah. But don't have fun getting pregnant. Oops. How has your day been so far? Also, when is Goose coming back? It's funny that you say that. I got to see Goose today. If you don't know, Goose is my dog. And Goose is an aggressive, hyperactive dog, so she's been at a dog training program all summer. Goose is kind of like a One Directioner as a dog. She will go f***ing nuts when she's excited about something. And she will go f***ing nuts when she is upset about something. So she's learning to find that middle ground like you One Directioners should. Anyway, my day is great. Why don't you do any of the cooking bits anymore? I understand the creative stress of thinking of something new and appetizing, but I just dot dot dot. Why don't you finish your sentences anymore? The beginning of this comment was so articulate and made me feel something and then I just... I love doing cooking bits and cooking bits will continue, don't worry. I just haven't been in one place, uh, let alone a kitchen place, to make something for you. I have ideas. I'll give you one word. Soup? No, that's not even a clue. I haven't thought of anything. Soup could be good. I've never made a soup. Breakfast soup. No, that's just cereal. How do you find time to de-stress between all of your work commitments? Like that. What do you usually eat for breakfast? It varies. You know, sometimes I have a granola bar. This morning I had a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup and a mini Twix. Other mornings I usually eat my pride because I can't remember what happened the night before. What is a prank you would love to do to someone? I would really love to replace their Gatorade with urine. Apart from the release of your book, is there anything you are really looking forward to right now? I'm super excited by this idiot's book. Beautiful dum-dum. My Drunk Kitchen, a guide to eating, drinking, and going with your gut by the one and only Hannah Hart. Look at that. It looks so cool. I watched firsthand Hannah work really hard on this book, and now I know firsthand how hard it is to work on a book. So I'm just really proud and I'm excited for her. If you haven't already, go to hannahurt.com slash book and pre-order yours! How do I motivate myself to work out? Here's a little song that I like to sing to myself that motivates me to work out. You are a piece of shit. You are a human turd. No one thinks you're great because you're a feces from a butthole. It, it's pretty helpful. Thoughts on Troye Sivan's song. I don't want to give my thoughts away right now because they might be coming out later this week. I am really excited to talk about like all the racist undertones. That's a fun name for a, a ska band, racist undertones. How does one understand the subject of adulthood and maturity? Asking for a friend. I mean, just casually do my stretches. That's it for another edition of Interrogated's Grace. I hope this 
was fun for you. I didn't hate every second of it, just some seconds here and there scattered. Every time I get to the part where I'm, I should be doing like call to action, like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to follow me on other social platforms. I feel like such a <laughs> tool. I don't know. Don't forget to buy your tickets to our No Filter show using the link in the description below. Also, somehow I got nominated for a Teen Choice Award. I don't know. But if you want, you can vote for me at the link in the description. I think it's teenchoiceawards.com slash vote. I don't know. Just, you know, have a great time. GraceSkyBook.com and a heart.com slash book. Oh, boy.